Island beds have been a popular addition to the Bailey portfolio for a number of years now, and the Vigo has all the advantages of an island bed, but without compromising on lounge space. <laughs> Now this caravan has an MTPLM figure, that's a maximum figure of 1600 kilos, which means it can be towed with a Volvo V60 plug-in hybrid or similar. Now this is a popular couples caravan, but it can also be used to take away family members or occasional guests. So let's go and have a look inside to see why. Now the Vigo has a fixed island bed which is in front of me, but it still has a very roomy front lounge, which is helped by this infinity window that's 50% larger than the Unicorn 4's window, as well as these new curved locker doors. Now the seat in which I'm sitting on can either be used as a double bed if you have occasional guests, or they're five foot eight long and could be used as singles. The most important thing is, these are now sprung rather than foam. So from the comfort of the front lounge, we move on to the practicalities of the kitchen. There are two TV points, one here and one behind me here, which means you can watch telly from the lounge or from the bedroom. There are four USB points in the caravan and six 230 volt sockets. Now the kitchen has new worktops for the Unicorn 5 with mid-level lighting below, which means you can see into the cutlery drawer. It has a separate grill and oven along with a three burner gas hob and an electric single hob as well. Now this cover pulls down, which gives you even more worktop space. Worthy of a mention, the microwave doesn't have a glass plate. It doesn't need one. This design from Dometic can do without that, which makes traveling that much easier. Below the microwave is the all important wine rack, which can hold four bottles. And opposite the wine rack is a 133 liter Dometic fridge freezer. Now separating the kitchen and the lounge from the bedroom is a concertina partition door. The Vigo has a transverse island bed, which means it goes across the width of the caravan. Now new for the Unicorn 5 is a curved cupboard, which allows for a much wider bed. Either side of the bed is also a nice cubby hole, allowing you to keep your nighttime essentials, as well as a USB port above in the light. At the foot of the bed is a vanity unit, which includes a mirror, another telly point, as well as a socket that can be used either for the telly or for a hairdryer. The bed has two modes. It has day mode and night mode. Now in day mode as it is now, it's pushed right back in, which gives you all this room at the foot of the bed to walk around. Now in night mode, it actually pulls out to give you plenty of room for that good night's sleep. And if you want to carry bulkier items such as chairs or picnic tables, they can be stored underneath the fixed bed, which is also accessible from a locker door outside. The Vigo has an end washer which runs the full width of the caravan. There's new storage in there, as well as a new Belfast style sink and a new splashback. There's a separate shower as you'd expect in a unicorn, and above the shower, there's a handy little hook where you can hang things like wet coats or towels. So in summary, the Unicorn 5 Vigo. It's a single axle caravan with a large fixed island bed. But that fixed island bed doesn't take away from the fact it has that roomy front lounge with that all important infinity front window.